Hello everyone, um, we're just loading up and we're off to, it's what, not? Five to nine. I was not a very happy bunny waking up this morning. <laughs> no, and uh, we're off to Bournemouth today, aren't we, to go and get you a tattoo. So we are indeed. Where are we going? We're going to Versus Inc. Overlook Tattoo. There so there's there's uh, Versus Inc, which is um, uh, one of the, the Facebook places, um, but Overlook Tattoo is the um, the the uh, like the, their email address and stuff like that. So I'm not sure if it's like somebody who who rents out that area, or we'll find out when we get there. Mm. Right, let's head off road trip. So um, we've just on our way to Bournemouth and uh, Downton. We got stopped by the uh, Vosa. Um, for... And unfortunately, because it is my fault that Nick's been running around so much for me recently because of my logistics with my wheelchair. So, great car, I can't use it because I can't use my wheelchair. So, unfortunately, it means that Nick's been doing a lot more for me recently. So, you haven't actually had the time to get your tyre fixed because you were too busy helping me get in and out and manage to get to my appointments. So, Unfortunately, it's kind of. Um, well, I knew it was. I feel like it's my no, but it, I feel like it's my fault because you haven't had a chance to do it. Because no, by now it's getting low. I mean, I was planning to drop you and go and get a tire this afternoon. Well, that's exactly yeah. That's whilst exactly you were getting the your irony, tattoo. So the irony. It's, it's my my carer's van. Basically, I, I roped him into something, so I'm, I'm, I feel kind of guilty. <laughs> um, so uh, the man from Pro Tires arrived um, about an hour after we called him. Yeah, Steve. I, I spoke to Steve on the phone and he was absolutely lovely. Here's our saviour. He hasn't even come with his cake. So yeah, Pro Tire are here. They're pretty quick to pretty quick to respond. And he's turned up and we're uh, we're getting our tires done. So we've arrived after our uh, little mission with the tires and uh, a little bit stressy finding car parks, but we're we're here yeah, now. They don't really have very much signposting for car parks, which is rather frustrating. But yeah. never mind, it's part of the building. We're here now, so I've got uh, Sisyphus out, so uh, um, let's go. I'm also ta I'm also using these new crutches, which I'm trying out because my other crutches at the moment seem to be giving me back and shoulder problems. So I'm it's slick and I'm all colour coordinated for, for once in my life. Huh? Yeah, let's see how this rolls. So it gets rather frustrating. So you have to adapt and you get weird and wonderful ways that you learn to adapt to these things. So top tip. Okay, so we've uh, arrived at the uh, right location this time. Yeah, fee fucked up big time. So we didn't realise that uh, Bournemouth Inc. actually had two. Um, well, three locations. Three actually, locations. Yeah. So, sub all, we went to the wrong one first. The lady was rude. And she... I would recommend personally that if you're going to Inc. to Bournemouth, make sure that you don't go to. Um, you make sure you ring up first because her attitude is terrible. So, anyway, we found the right place. We've popped in to say hello. They're just having a bite to eat. So, and designing. Yeah, and designing um, I the got new soap, tattoo. So, I'm a, bit, I'm a bit wet. So, we decided to chill. We've got an hour or so. So, we decided to chill in the van because I'm absolutely bloody soaked. Yeah, so we're just. And we're eating some food because yeah. I'm also knackered. So, we stopped off and grabbed a quick McDonald's. So, we're just going to have a bite to eat and then uh, go in for the tattoo. Yeah. These new sticks that her mum got her, which has to be said, are actually pretty good. They got. Big I feet. forget how to walk with them though. So it's just different than your other ones. Yeah. Different gait. So I had to click my hips in. Look at yeah, those. Straight, yeah, they're pretty fly. So yeah, we're going around and we're going to uh, go and get the tattoo. Um, I am having the um, Alberto is uh, designing the tree of life for me um, so that I can, um, I don't know how to describe it, so a silhouette of a tree of life with um, some colours behind it and, um, and then a quote from an Emily Bronte poem that my mum read um, at my dad's funeral, so. So it's a sentimental tattoo, oh, and, and the, but the tree of life to signify that life goes on. To well, signify how the past, the present, and the future all kind of intermingle to each other. Cool. So whilst we're uh, whilst we're waiting, it's being lovingly drawn up on the uh, on the iPad. By the Alberto's, resident. I've also shaming my technology kind yep. of knowledge to the point where I'm just Art like, I'm gonna stand over here. Artistic talent along with use of technology. So uh, designs all done. 
and uh, the the writing has been designed and then the uh, tree is going to be free-handed so size. it's all being set up now so that's that's what you're having that's creepy yeah that's pre-pain <laughs> She's signing her life away to uh, authorise the tattooist to uh, lay ink on her. <laughs>